been a while since I've done one of these. I've been on this platform for, I believe, a little bit under six years. Um, and when I was young, I obviously took this as a opportunity to express myself and be like the role model that I had at the time, which was Markiplier. And I was luckily given the gift of speaking to him and having a small chunk of his audience come my way. Um, and that's something that I'm eternally grateful for. I think anybody that is on this channel currently is well aware of the state of it. And it's been dead for a little while. And I'm okay with that. Um, I came to grips with that a pretty long time ago. And it was to be expected. I was very young. Still am. I think I was 18 at the time. I was still in high school. And I just couldn't handle it. It, it wasn't the time. I was still in school. I didn't have the time nor the finesse to cultivate a channel um, with what I knew and what I had been given. And that's okay. I met some pretty interesting people and whereas I don't think any of them are in my life anymore, uh, at least personally, um, I'm still glad that they came. And it was a really fun thing to have in the moment for those couple years. Um, and again, couldn't be more grateful that it happened. I went to college and kind of grew up a little and noticing the, the number, not that it's about numbers, but watching my uh, tiny following dwindle was painful and it was just something that I had to come to grips with. Um, Again, just wasn't the right time. And uh, my motivation to be a creator suffered very much. And uh, that was before I learned that I had become interested in music. And fine, you know, that was a art form that I could partake in that I didn't have to be on camera. Uh, because being on camera was becoming more and more difficult as my living situation changed. Uh, obviously, I moved. Uh, I don't live in the same apartment that I did, and the apartment that I started with was my father's house. And I can still record there, but it takes a lot of um, pre-planning to do that sometimes, and just something that I kind of became tired of doing after a while, or something that I was only okay with doing every now and again. Um, my heart wasn't really in it anymore. And I feel bad, somewhat. I don't know really how to feel about it. I feel bad because my lack of motivation kind of blinded me to the fact that even if it was like a small number, or even if it was like a tiny, tiny, tiny portion of people, um... There were people here and there that really enjoy my content. And I kind of let them down. I kind of just disappeared without saying anything. Um, and even if it isn't the majority, uh, you know, it still mattered to that individual. So I'm sorry. I don't think I'll ever be done until I'm fully done with making content, period. Um... There may be a gaming video here and there, but in mass, that's probably going to be the end of it. My life has taken such a weird turn. Um, as you may have seen, my grandmother passed away. It was a sign of a change of the times in my life. Um, very difficult times. Um, a really rough point in my life where... I'd lost this figure that I had looked up to, and um, I'd just come out of a relationship that I was heavily invested in, and I had just moved, 
lot of weird and life-changing transition periods and coping with that. And I made some new friends along the way, which is cool. Um, but definitely odd, definitely difficult. And I had people to guide me, maybe less so than I used to, um, but I'm grateful for those people nonetheless. My mental health has taken a pretty steep dive, um, and I won't get too much into detail, but it's been really rough, probably rougher than it's ever been for me. Um, but I've been taking it one day at a time um, and trying to take the steps with the people I love to recovering from what I was going through. I was given this camera by my uncle. I wish I had got this sooner so I could make a little bit more higher quality content, but what happens happens and I have it now uh, and I'm glad to see it. I was just given my first dose of the vaccine today and um, it's been a long time coming. <laughs> Honestly, I was a little afraid. Um, I'm not a huge fan of having my skin pierced. It gives me the heebie-jeebies. Um, and I was just hoping that, you know, it's got the intended purpose and it won't kill me. I doubt it will, but, you know, obviously there's some fear in that. It was made pretty quick. And I don't particularly know what it is. I've been working my tail off as a Starbucks barista. I've been working there almost a year to the day, actually. Um, and I've been saving up for a car and teaching myself how to budget my money and stuff like that. Very much stumbling my way through the beginnings of my adulthood in this weird stage of my life. And I just hope that I'll have the help and the knowledge and the um, wherewithal to see it through. Hopefully I'll be working at a guitar center because currently I do hate my job. And I, and if it were time to quit, I would quit immediately. In terms of content for me and the content that I want to make, I miss doing those discussion videos that I did all those years ago. And I like giving my two cents on things. Anybody that knows me lo knows that I love to talk and explain and yammer and ramble, kind of like I'm doing right now. Whenever I have something that I would like to talk about to share, it will be on this channel. I know it isn't in line with the purpose of what this channel used to be, but it's my channel and I can do whatever the fuck I want with it. It's about me, and I think I deserve to put whatever I want on it. I'm aware that people will most likely always be leaving this channel, and people will eventually come, um, especially with the shift in content, more so focused on me and what I'm thinking about, more so than just playing a game. And if that isn't right for you, or if it doesn't interest you, um, thank you for sticking with me at whatever time you did, and I appreciate it. And I hope you have a good life. And I thank you for the support that you gave me.